Oh, I feel like I have to sneeze. <laughs> oh, I lost it. Hey guys! What's well, something different? Yeah, we got our hair done. It's getting warmer. Summer's Summary. on its way, though if you lived where we live, you wouldn't think it because it's been raining and cloudy and nasty every single day. It's disgusting outside. So I don't know about you guys, but I've been seeing the Sephora VIB hauls happening all, all over the, time. the place. And so that inspired us to go to Sephora and shop. Plus I needed a new eyebrow pencil. Excuses. Thumbs up if you don't need that many excuses to go to Sephora and have fun. I can always go to Sephora, right? Always. always. So, we're gonna show you what we got. But first, if you're not already subscribed to our channel, you should do that because then you'll know when we upload new stuff. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Aw, uh, as Dame Drops would say. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get into the Sephora haul and show you what we got. Obviously, I got way more than Tracy. Ooh. So the first thing I picked up was a new Anastasia Brow Wiz. You know what? What? I've been using other brow pencils and I've been happy. In fact, today's brows are done by <laughs> Today's brows are brought to you by Senna Cosmetics. I, I, I don't even know if there's cosmetics to that. I just know it's Senna, sketch a brow. Today I was like, yay, I'm gonna do my brows with my new Anastasia. But spoiler, I already told you I didn't because when I opened it, that happened. But it was much more violent and much more like flying across my bathroom. So needless to say, A, that's not a whole lot of product. I hope that there's more down in there, but I don't want to roll it up because I'm just going to return it because the next time I do it, it's going to go down my sink drain. I can talk. Other reason why we went to is because girl needed a booty blender. This is the new invisible one. Yeah. They're clear, so you don't even know you're using it. Or a girl needed it so badly that she used it already, could not even wait for it. And for some reason, this one was gigantic when I put water in it. And I'm like, have we been using knockoffs? Like, why is it so big? I mean, we've gotten a lot of ours from IMAX. I don't know. Unless there's like different sizes of them. I mean, cause it was normal to the normal size that I saw in here, but I'm telling you, the surface area of the top of it is like that big. Gigantic. It's huge. So I had to get one of those. So I made my way over to the little clearance section because girl loves good deal. They had this fragrance sampler pack, which I've really been enjoying using rollerball fragrance because I can carry it with me. And it's also a good way for me to know if I love a fragrance enough to buy a full size. So this was only $15.99, which means that I will get to redeem for one of these rollerballs. And then the rollerball only cost me $15.99 instead of like, like And some of them are more than that. Yeah. Some of them are like 28. 28. You get to try six samples and then you have a little gift certificate where you can go redeem. And it's Calvin Klein Euphoria, Elizabeth and James, the black and white, Sky Joyful, Juicy Couture, Viva Juicy, and Stella McCartney, Stella. I'm torn between Joyful, Nirvana, Black. Oh, you like the black more than the white one? Yeah, I think so. Not sure. I just couldn't say no. I got a fragrance sample as well. But I got the bigger one because I had two of the however many perfumes were in that one. So I didn't know what I would want to get full size from that one. But I had a couple ideas of what I would want to get full size for this one. This one's a little pricey. This one is 58, but I have not bought a perfume in a minute. Yay! I've controlled myself, and I'm really excited because it has the new Prada in there, and C, which I love, but I only have the rollerball up, so maybe I'll get the full size of C, and a bunch of other ones that smell pretty tasty, so. It also has a nail polish in there. Speaking of nail polish, I'd like to invite you to the white party. This says, a new way to wear white, and it's four nail polishes, and four crisp cool shades lightened and brightened for a look that's chic, bold, and white hot. And I like the Formula X nail polishes, so I I think that I'm going to like these because sometimes, like I've said, wearing just plain white on my nails looks like white out. Yeah. So that's like tinted white nail yeah. polish. So it looks like there's kind of a cream color, a peach, a blue tint, and a mint green tint. I have been kind of like I really love lip liner pencils, but kind of also like my lips really like to bleed. So I kind of am starting to feel like I need lip pencils. So I got two from Urban Decay because I've always tried their like eyeliner, but I've never tried their lip liner. And so I got two of the 24 seven glide on lip pencils. I got one in a nice kind of nudie natural pink color called Mo Rush. It's very movie. Yes, very Kylie Jenner. <laughs> I was gonna say it's been a while since we've said that name, but it has not been. And then I got a hot pink one cause it's summer and I love having bright lips over the summer and this is called Cat Night. Ooh. All right, this was on the little sample section and I'm super glad I picked it up because I just love lippies. <laughs> 
I don't really have a good reason. This is 15, you get three lipsticks in here and they're supposed to be nude perfection from Bare Minerals. It says customize your perfect nude lip. It's like a decent size, little bullet. Little bullet. It's not a pretty color. It's a really pretty color. And then the other one is a lighter, more like, I tried when, to nude. Like when you were picking out stuff, I tried to be like, not that I don't care what she's picking out, but like, I'm not gonna pay attention to it so much because then I would pick up the exact same thing. So right. I we just pretty set much, apart. Yeah, we pretty much separated this time in Sephora and we kind of did our own thing and picked our own stuff out, so. I am so excited for those. <laughs> Another quick repurchase that I did was the Kat Von D tattoo liner. I love it. I went back to my old one recently and it was dried up. So another one. Okay, so this is actually a repurchase for me and it's the Stila Smudge Stick in Damsel. I love this smudge stick because it's almost black, but it's brown and I just recently ran out of it. Yeah. And I've been trying to like use other products in my collection, but nothing compares. Yeah, so. That's how you know you love something. It, exactly, and so Stila Damsel, it's expensive, but I love it. This one was that thing that I bought, <laughs> was influenced by people on YouTube. <laughs> and it's a Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water and it smells delicious. I don't know what it smells like. We think it smells like tea. The idea is that you can use it before you put on your makeup. You can use it to refresh your face during the day. I wanted it, but they only had one. Of the trial Of size. the travel size. Yeah, so. trial travel. Yeah, I picked up the big one originally and I think it was like 30 or 40 bucks. And I was like, oh, it's expensive, but I really want to try it. Okay, but then I saw this at the cash off and I was like, done. 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 Even if it's not a better value, I get to try it for only $16. I was just all about the sets, apparently, and I saw this up at the register. Again, that place sucks me in every stinking time. It's like a money trap, but it's a wonderful money trap. It's a it money trap it. that makes me happy. This is a sample pack of the Clean Perfume, and we just recently got a sample of the original one in our Birch Box. And we've had the clean skin before. Yeah. I just didn't realize how much I liked these clean scents. Like, I I love them. I'm gonna when I them. smell them, I'm like, oh, I like that. They had all of these out so you could smell them, and I was like, I love every single one of these. I want all of them. I know. Like, the... I think Rain is my favorite. It smells super strong. But it's not. Which I is like why it. I think you can layer it. Like, so, I got lip product that I'm wearing. It's Too Faced Melted with by Long Wear Lipstick. And I got it just so I could tell people that I have jelly donut on my lips. It's so beautiful. Just take a jelly donut and wipe it on your lips. No, I got it because I a it's summer and I wanted, you know, bright colors. And I have melted fig, which is kind of like a purpley smooth color. And so I wanted a hot pink color because I like the way that these wear. And I'm all out of reasons. I just got it because it's called donut. Jelly donut. And now I've never had donut. I've never had a jelly donut. I'm either. And I like jelly on my bagels, but jelly and donut freaks me out. We jelly should donut. Do Girls tried jelly donuts for the first time. There's so many things I've never tried, you guys. So the cash wrap strikes again. Yes, it did. Why are you calling it cash wrap? Well, because usually that's what you call it around the cash. But this is more of the, like the maze before oh. you even get to the cash wrap. Oh. Although they had these at the cash wrap too. Okay, so this is from Bite Beauty. You guys. Okay. Do you remember when we went to New Jersey and hung out with Courtney and her mom, and we got one of these? And is that when we got it? I know we got one of them back Oh, then. I don't know if it was then. I was watching their vlog on Pop Gnome. Oh yeah, when they made the yes! Bite lipstick. I want to go! They went to New York and they made lipstick. I know, it's really fun. Yeah, like you can make your own dang lip color. I know, I didn't even know that that, and you I can make it either. center. And it was so cute, and then they were like, oh look, there's Birchbox, we want to go there. And they didn't know you could go to Birchbox, yeah. and they built their own box and everything. I was so jealous of people who live in or around New York. I know. We've had these before, I love them. It's two colors in one, little stick. You got different colors this time. So I got one that has fig and date on it and these are like the most perfect. This is just disaster waiting Don't get them mixed up because you won't know which is which. So it's like a more nudie color and, and then rose. like a pinky rose. God, I wanted it so bad. You didn't get it? No, I didn't get it because they had these two bright colors and what does Stephanie want right now? She wants bright colors. But look at her lips, right? I mean, so this one is in tangerine, and I'm gonna butcher this lingonberry. That's the Swedish thing. They have it. it they have like lingonberry juice and stuff at IKEA. That's right, lingonberry. Yeah. Ling I said lingon it right. Lingonberry. Lingonberry. Okay. Lingonberry. So gonna... this side's tangerine, and it's like a bright coral, orangey tangerine. And then the other color is like a purpley, like berry. The lipstick is sweaty. That's really pretty. I did a little quick 250 point thing because racking up the points. And I rarely spend the points because I there's never anything I like. But I smelled this blooming bouquet by Miss Dior. And at first I didn't love it, 
And then I loved it. Did you? Yeah, and so I got it. And I don't even know what it smells like, but I actually think it smells more clean and sweet. Yeah. Which is something that I never get from like Chanel. It's usually either really spicy or really floral. Mm -hmm. So I just have a little sweet scent. And if this was in that sample pack, I probably would get this full size. So I'm kind of slightly sad, but it's not. So that's not Chanel. It's Dior. Not Chanel. It's not what I meant. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> okay, so I thought that I really wanted to try the Urban Decay Naked Skin Weightless Complete Coverage Concealer Light Diffusing Peptide Infused. I got it in fair neutral because that was the only light option they had. They had like medium and dark and clearly that's not gonna highlight my under eyes. I'm really pale. So far, I like it. I used it today. Ooh. It looks good. So, so far, so good. All right, guys, that is everything we got from Sephora. We want to know if you guys have picked up any awesome things lately, and what should we pick up the next time we go? Because you know we're going to go. No, we're going right after this video. All right, guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Also, subscribe because so you can see the video. Yes, if you're new to our channel, thank you for watching. And we're going to talk to you guys in another video so very soon. We sure will. Bye, guys.